Uh, if you could grab a seat, we're going to start. We're going to try to keep things right on time. Uh, those of you who have been to lens conferences before know that timeliness is uh, one of the things that we really like to emphasize. To welcome you this morning, uh, Dean Levy's taken some time out of his schedule to uh, say hello. Dean. Thank you. Welcome, everybody. Um, thank you for being here. Thank you, Charlie. This is a, an annual conference. It's always amazing. Uh, the, the, the law school is so proud of its Lens Center. It was founded by Robinson Everett. You, I'm sure you know that name. And then Scott Silliman, who's here, Judge Silliman, uh, for many years was the director and now uh, General and Professor Dunlap. And it's a, a dynamic center, and it does so, so much for us. Thank you for, for braving the elements to be here. I'm, I'm sure for most of you, if you grew up in Chicago as I did, uh, you're puzzled by by what you find here, and uh, you say to yourself, gee, uh, it's winter, um, deal with it. And it's not even uh, anything comparable to what you experience elsewhere. Uh, but the people here have a vision, and their vision is that it's the South, and therefore it's warm, and uh, there isn't snow, and every year they're proved wrong. Uh, and that, in a way, uh, is maybe the theme of our conference. You know, um, we have a vision. We have a vision of war, and it is that you can fight a war to end all wars, and then they're they're over and and they're done with, and you fight them against other other states. And uh, we even have in mind that maybe you kind of line up and you shoot at one another, and uh, it hasn't been that way for a very long time. So if you think about it, if you if you were sort of coming from Chicago and looking at our history, you would say, gee, uh, you know, Britain and France were head of forever war from roughly 1760 to 1815. And, and there have been many periods, look at the 17th century, that was a forever war uh, between the forces of the Reformation and the forces of uh, one might call it international Catholicism. And uh, those wars seemed like forever wars. And if you look at what we're looking at here in the Middle East now, in, in many respects, these are, these are continuous with movements and problems and issues and strife, ethnic, religious, and otherwise geopolitical, that have existed for hundreds of years. And yet, we don't think of it that way, because our concepts have one vision of the way the world ought to be and the way we want it to be. And the reality maybe has, has been different. So. This is a great opportunity to think about uh, what might be a disconnect. Uh, we have excellent, superb people here. I won't take any of your time further, but just to say we very much appreciate your being here. Welcome to Duke. Thank you very much. And let me echo what the deans.